the newly released Parallels Desktop 17 has lots of new features. In this short video, I will show you 5 of the most visually compelling features. Here are the 5 features shown in this video. First, the faster launch speed. Parallels Desktop 17 is a universal binary which is optimized for both the Intel-based Mac and the M1-based Mac. On both, there are a variety of performance improvements. Here I will show you how fast Parallels Desktop 17 launches on an M1 MacBook Pro. Notice that Parallels Desktop is not currently running. When I click on the Microsoft Access icon in the Mac dock, Parallels Desktop will be launched, Windows 11 will be booted, and Microsoft Access will be started. As you can see from the digital clock in the Mac menu bar, this took less than 4 seconds. Faster launching is great, but what about the speed in actually using applications? In particular, what about applications that use lots of graphics? Here is a website that benchmarks vertical synchronization and frames per second. Among the many parameters measured in this benchmark, you can see a speed of about 59 to 60 frames per second. You might be wondering what the frames per second speed was in Parallels Desktop 16.5. As you can see in this screenshot, the frames per second speed was about 37, so Parallels Desktop 17 includes a significant graphics speed improvement. I will show you the effect of this speed improvement in some games later in this video. Next, apps running in Windows on ARM. On the M1 MacBook Pro you run the version of Windows for ARM. However, you can still run the Windows apps you need. Here is Microsoft Word for Windows. And here is Excel for Windows. Here is Corel Draw 2021. Here is the Microsoft Store app. And here is a game from the Microsoft Store, Water Sort Puzzle. Of course, this short video cannot show all the many Windows applications that run well in Parallels Desktop 17 on the Apple M1 MacBook Pro. Another new feature in Parallels Desktop 17 is drag and drop of text and graphics from Windows apps to Mac apps, and from Mac apps to Windows apps. Here I am dragging text from Word in the Windows 11 VM to text edit on the Mac. And here I am dragging a graphic from text edit on the Mac to Word for Windows. There are many performance improvements for graphics in Parallels Desktop 17, but the biggest improvements are for apps that use OpenGL for two-dimensional graphics, like the game Smelter. In earlier versions of Parallels Desktop, this game was unplayably slow, but in Parallels Desktop 17 it plays great. Here is a very short clip of Smelter gameplay. And just to show graphics improvements in another game, here is Kingdom Rush Frontiers. Archers ready for honor and glory for the king. Freedom! One of the apps bundled with Parallels Desktop is Parallels Toolbox, which consists of more than 40 single purpose tools for you to quickly complete a wide variety of common tasks. A new tool in Parallels Toolbox is the Recognize Text tool, which can extract text from an image. Here I will extract the text from this screenshot of a dialogue. I hope you have enjoyed seeing these 5 new features in Parallels Desktop 17. Thanks for watching.